Good evening, everybody. Oh, I haven't got my glasses on. I can't see anything. Well, I can, but not there. I'll have a look. Let me turn this way for a minute. Good. Oh, look at you. You're all arriving now. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hope you've all had a lovely day. I have got Oh, a cracking live for you tonight. I'm so excited about this one. So excited. And you are going to love it. Absolutely love it. So let me get myself a little bit organised. Pop my glasses on. And then I will say hello to a few people. If you could kindly do your regular jobs and like and share for me all over social media. Let's get us out there and let's get people joining the... Um, Exciting world of Lisa Horton Crafts. Right, I'm just going to go to my phone and do exactly what I've told you to do. So, or asked you to do. Now, that is, um, oh, let me find it. Let me find it. Where am I? Where am I? You, oh, you think I'd be an expert at this by now. So, Lisa Horton Crafts, let me grab the post. Oh, my volume's on. I'll have to turn that down in a minute or it's going to go bing bong all evening. I'm going to drive you insane. So, share, right post, change that to my feed. So, everyone knows I'm here now. That's good. That's good. Right, this is a cracking live tonight, guys. You are going to really enjoy this. So, let me turn the volume down here. And I will say hello to everybody. So, have you noticed something different? I haven't got my headband in tonight. And I've straightened my hair because my favourite headband broke and it all came unravelled. And I've got to go shopping tomorrow and invest in some new ones for Tuesday. So, yeah, I haven't got that on tonight. But I look strange because most people are used to me with my headband. Right, let's say hello to some people. Oh my God, there's lots of you here. Let's start. Good evening, Deborah. Good evening, Jackie. Good evening, Irene. Good evening. Oh, so I'll say hello to myself then. <laughs> good evening, Bella. Good evening, Dawn. Good evening, Karen. Good evening, Gabrielle. Good, good evening, Maureen, um, Elaine, Molly, Marilyn. Emma, Beverly, oh, Doreen, oh, I've missed loads of you, Con, Karen, hi from Phoenix, I tried to, have I got the time right, Karen, does that mean it's 11am for you, have I got this, these right, because it said EDT as well as EST, so it's, I know it's daylight and summertime, but what's the difference? Is it an hour forward or back or something? I didn't want to get it wrong. Hi, Sue. Hi, Susie. Hi, Molly. Hi, Liz. Hi, Jean. Hi, Amanda. Oh, goodness me. Hi, Carol. Hi, Christine. Hi, Free to Div. But I can't remember who that is. You will tell me, and I will know exactly who you are. Um, hi, Pam. Oh, there's loads of you here. So I'm going to wait for just a few more to come along. Hi, Ben. Oh, you're going to like this. And I've saved you some too. <laughs> Famous last words, eh? But no, I have. I promise. Promise. Um, this is probably one of my favourite releases of the year so far. Hi, Jill. Hi, Pat. Thank you. For, oh, hi, Tina C. Hi from California whilst working. Oh, you naughty lady. Hi, Hannah. Hi, Adele. I mean, I won't keep saying it because, and I keep doing it because I do it every time and I say I'm going to stop and I don't stop. I think your hair looks cute like you have it today. Oh, thanks, Christina. Lily said I look like, um, when I had it done the other day, she said I looked boring and a bit mumsy. But today I look all right. So I think, I think for a 15-year-old, that's a compliment. <laughs> well, I'll take it anyway. Right, lots of you here. Looking forward to seeing the new products. You are going to see <laughs> a lot of new products. How is your stock delivery gone? I'm okay about it. I'm not so sure Danny is. But, you know, it keeps him fit is all I can say. 
ET, oh hang on, I've missed that, I've missed that. EDT is Eastern Daylight Saving Time, EST is Eastern Standard Time. So, are you eight hours behind the UK Eastern Time? And then there's another area which is five hours behind. I get very confused, very confused. Brilliant, lovely, loads of you here. Right, have you had your hair cut? It looks great. Pat, no, I haven't actually. If I turn around this way, you can actually see my hair's grown. My hair when I first came to TV was so short, so short cut into the back of my neck over my ear. And then lockdown happened and I started to grow it and I started to kind of like it grown. And it's got to pass that dodgy stage where now I can kind of almost get away with not having to have my hair bands in all the time. Although it's quite nice to keep in the hair off my face. I just need to sort out a fringe or a not a real fringe, but a little kind of fringe at some point. Okay, Eastern is five hours behind. West Coast is eight hours. Cool, right, I've got it right. I think I've got it right now. I think I put the right times on the little, little thing then. Okay, Susan, there was a going to be crafted on tonight, but I did put a note in the group to say I'm really sorry, but I had to move it to next week because I've got a show on Tuesday and I do need to do the show and tell with you. So I've pushed it forward pushed it back so it's next week so it's definitely still happening but I did apologize and say unfortunately we've had to move it around just a little bit okay brilliant fabulous okay where do we start now I'm going to start off with an apology I'm always doing this aren't I and I'm going to apologize that I have one finished sample <laughs> the reason being is that you saw the delivery that arrived yesterday well, it's for the show on Tuesday. And obviously, I can't get it out to my DT in time to create samples. I'll take my glasses off a bit. Um, can't get it out to the DT in time to make samples and get them back to me. I've sent them to the lovely Mary, who is one of my DT. Well, I haven't sent them. Danny drove over to Brighton and delivered them. And, and Mary's got the grand sum of three days to pretty much, do, no pressure Mary, to create the entire counter for me. <laughs> I am gonna try and help, I promise, I promise. But she's kind of in charge of samples on this occasion. Um, but the next show, um, I'm gonna give her a little rest and the team should have some cracking stuff to be crack to, to be getting on with for the next shows. So uh, apologies, but I will do a couple of little demos for you, a little with the overhead, just to show you how some of the things work because it's really nice for you to see them. I do know stock is loaded onto Crate & Craft. They have done what they did last time and they have limited the stock numbers because we have a feeling, although I have increased stock substantially from my last show to this show, albeit there was a little bit of shenanigans going on behind the scenes with my stock, but that has been resolved and we have made sure that um, people can't grab too many things and pop them in their baskets and then hang on to them and chuck them out at the last minute. Um, that's all been sorted, which is great news. And um, yeah, you will sure you should find there's plenty of stock for you all on Tuesday. So should we get straight into it? Right, I'm going to go through everything that's on the show for you because there are things that are returning, things that you have been waiting for. And actually, I'm going to start with those because I think we're going to do the build up and you'll see the reason I have put these on the show as well. Now, we've done a little bit of repackaging as well, which you will see in the newer stuff, but it will it will all come together. The reason being is freight charges have gone up. Um, I'm trying to be careful with costs, obviously, with everything that's happened with the Aurelius and, and other brands at the moment. And I'm trying to make sure that I keep myself safe. I keep my manufacturers safe and I keep you safe. So what we've done is we've shrunk the package as much as we can. And it's also, also retail friendly. So when you go into the shop, it won't be a really big package um, with a small amount inside. I hope Ben and, and Shirley who are here who are my retailers will also appreciate, you know, I'm not sure Shirley has a retail shop, but Ben certainly does. And hanging stuff on the wall, you know, you pay for that space on the wall. So to be able to get more out, it's always a benefit. It doesn't affect what's inside the package. It looks equally as good. And I've brightened the green slightly just to make it a lot more attractive. So the first thing I'm going to show you 
is if I had a pound for every time you asked me for this die, or when is it back? Well, I would be rich, I have to say, or it would pay for a flipping good meal out. I tell you that much. So the first thing we've got is this. If you want it, please, please get it because I've ordered as much as I could afford of this, as much as I could have, and it's not like 50 or 100, I've ordered as much as I could afford, but then it's going to be away for a little while because we've got Christmas and other things to focus on. So if you want this, please, please grab it. It's really, really important because it works with a lot of stuff that will be coming out for Christmas. That's the first thing. And that is still in the big packaging. And you will see going forward how the packaging has changed very slightly, very slightly, but it has. So the next thing, and there is a reason for these as well. I've reordered these. We have these on the show. And again, the same thing. There aren't a lot of these. And these, there aren't a lot of these. So if you can grab these, if you want them, I'm giving you a heads up now because what's coming in a minute, you'll go, ah, oh, I see why she's done that. And then this. I've been asked for this set of stencils. I do not know how many times. So this is back. This is back for my retailers. This is back for TV. Um, you adore this stencil. It's set of three with the, the markings on it as well as you like, um, as in the, your peg holes. So that's going to work in your Ultimate, which is back at the end of the month. So we've had that air freighted. I thought it was going to be in time for this show, but it wasn't, unfortunately. But it doesn't matter because this is a die show, really. Now, I'm led to believe this next bundle has been loaded, or this these well, this next bundle, these next items have been loaded, but they are meant to be the contingency. So, um, but we've put them on because again, they work with what's coming up. So these beauties, okay. This one, this one, and obviously this one. So these three are back on the show. And again, we don't have, we have plenty, but we don't have a gazillions amounts of stock. Are the Stitch Bubble Squares on Create and Craft as it says sold out on your website? Yes, this one, these are the ones, these are the ones that are on Create and Craft. They're on on Tuesday. Whether they've loaded the stock yet or not, I'm not sure. You have got me bankrupt. <laughs> sorry, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. So stencils are lovely, aren't they? So it's definitely worth. Have you got sound? If, Susie, if you, is it only you that's not got sound? Have the rest of you got sound? Let me make sure. I'll just wait for one of you to tell me. Mandy, it could be you need to put your uh, large bubble, it should cut, but you need to put it on an angle because it's so big. Don't put it straight, put it on an angle and it would definitely make a huge difference. Thank you. Thank you. That's great. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Con. Hi, Irene. Brilliant. Okay, so you can hear me. So there's some of the coming back things. And then I wanted to show you, look at this. We've gone, we've gone up market, guys. We've gone up market. Pick up and poke it all. So we have changed our supplier for these because I wanted them boxed. Um, the previous supplier couldn't box them for me. I wanted it because it's retail friendly. I wanted it because I can now offer it internationally as well. Um, I can I can sell it to my suppliers, uh, Ecstasy, Scrapbook, um, Scrapbook and Made Simple, I can sell it to any retailer I need to now because it's all it's all barcoded and it's all retail friendly. So the reason how you would tell the difference is, oh, let me undo it. Oh, I've broken the lid now, Lisa. You can see I've changed how my name appears so you'll know it's from the new supplier. So across the middle, it won't have the box around it. It will just say, well, you probably can't see that. But it says Lisa Horton Crafts, but it just doesn't have the box around it. It's a bit like on my stencil brushes. It's just got my name, but it hasn't got the box around the edge. So they're back. Now, again, I have got a lot of these. I tell you, I've got lots. 
So I haven't even just got hundreds, I've got lots of them. So hopefully they shouldn't be in short supply. They shouldn't be, they shouldn't be. Also stencil brushes will be back on and I did ask Danny to bring one up, but you know what they are anyway, the Bijou brushes. The Bijou brushes are back. We've got a lot of them. They are sold in packs of three now. They're on a really good deal. They are beautiful and they're gonna work beautifully with everything coming out as of 6th of January, January, 6th of June going forward. No worry about being late, Kerry. What time are you on CNC on Tuesday? I am on, I am launching the one day special at 6 p.m. I'm sure it's the one day special. Yeah, 6 p.m. one day special and 9 p.m. And then, is it 10 and 2 p.m. on the following day? I think, right. Okay, the, do you, have you seen the pokey tools, Joe? Do you know what? I'll open one and just show you because they are really cool. So they're really nice to hold. They're a really good weight. And then one end, you have your super sharp pokey tool, super sharp. And then you have your um, wax end. Remember, keep them out of strong sunlight because they're wax and keep them out of very cold temperatures because they get too brittle, they will crumble. But it doesn't matter because you can mold them with your fingers, warm your fingers, mold them with your fingers and they will come back. Look what else I've got, what Danny treated me to. Oh, I've got some fruit pastels. So do you mind if I eat a fruit pastel while I'm talking to you? Because I haven't had any dinner tonight. Well, not yet. And it's going to be late by the time I eat. I hope you don't think it's rude. I'll just put it inside of my mouth. Now I'll have a look at some comments and then we'll get into the... What's this sold out on my website, Kimberly? Because most the new all this stuff is on Crate and Craft. It's not on my website. Um, the bundle says so, sold out. It should be... It should be on there. And Nisha, I don't need your WhatsApp number, sweetheart. Thank you. So goodbye. Um, let's get rid of that. Excellent. There we go. Right. New stuff. New stuff. And I'm going to show you how it works. I am going to make a prediction. They are individual, but you're going to buy the bundle. And I know you're going to buy the bundle because they all work together. So let's look at the old packaging. So let's go. This is the old packaging, okay? This is the new packaging. So not a lot of difference. It's brighter. It is smaller. It's lost the gloss because um, we're working with Crate and Craft and we're trying to make everything as um, eco-friendly as possible. So although this makes it a little bit more stable, this makes it more environmentally friendly. And for me... That's what works. So these are smaller. We're going to be able to send them out in smaller envelopes. It's going to make life an awful lot easier. Now, this is absolutely cracking. How long till the new items hit ecstasy and scrapbook in the US? No cranking crap. Let, I will have a, I will, I will come back to that in just a second. Let me just show you these and I'll talk about all that in a second if that's okay. So this is what you're going to get. Now, this is a gorgeous die set. I turn it around I'm going to show you here so down this side you're going to get an outside cutting edge and then you're going to get a die that is another outside cutting edge all right so we'll, I'll show you them properly in a minute and then you're going to get every one of these flowers now these flowers are gorgeous so you're going to be able to create look at these these overlay as well so they're going to be overlaying dies so you can have them as open dies you can have those closed dies they obviously have the same pattern here but they are just beautiful. Now you know why. Let me come back to, uh, hang on, let me come back to these. Now you know why they're on the show. Oops. And now you know why they're on the show, okay? Because they work together. They are absolutely beautiful. I can't begin to tell you. When I show you in a minute what they look like cut, you are going to be absolutely blown away by them. I'm thrilled with them. The lovely Mary, who's making samples, is going to show share some finished samples after the show as well. So next one. This is something I've been wanting to do for ages. 
and I love it. The sample I've got just cut is glorious. This is bows. So this is your rose of bows. Now turn it round again. We are going to get the outside edge and then we get another outside edge, which become clear. Then you get all your bows, all different sizes. Now, these are going to work brilliantly for what is coming out for Christmas. OK, all the dies are separate in these, Nikki. The reason they're put together is because it is a lot easier for packing. It's a lot safer for packing. Things don't get missed, don't get lost, but you can buy jewelry snips and the jewelry snips will cut them apart easily the bows are cracking now we did a christmas dye that had one bow in it so we've repeated that that bow but we've made it a different size okay so there is no repeat so i think it was that bow it might have been that was on the christmas packaging but this is a different size for you so it's going to be beautiful for your birthday cards for christmas cards for all sorts now the reason you're going to want the bundle is because of the next die and i haven't got a sample of this i haven't mary has i know that but i haven't i will have is this this is just flipping gorgeous it is really really gorgeous so what you are getting let me turn it around like this you get an outside cutting edge and then you get one half now this means right this means you just cut it twice you literally cut it twice and it will make a full wreath for you it doesn't matter how they join it really doesn't matter because you get all of these elements as well you get all of these flowers that go with it as well the wreath is gorgeous now this was inspired by my box kit okay because you love those cute little flowers you love the cute little flowers in box kit i think it was box kit one was it box kit one Yes, it was box kit one. So what we did is we put some stitch flowers in here as well. And they look beautiful overlaid. They look beautiful with all the extra elements in there. They are stunning. And again, let me hop back to these two and say, that's the reason these two are on the show. Okay. So that's part three of the bundle. Part four of the bundle is this. This is a little unsung hero. Now, I did I did one of these before, before the packaging change, but it isn't the same word, so this is different. This is one that cuts into your card, okay? Straight into your card with these words. So it's about four, it's 15 centimeters long, so it's gonna go on a six by six card, so you can cut straight across the middle, and it'll cut into the card, but then you have these two dies at the bottom here, so you can cut them out as well. So if you want to use that, top and bottom, you can cut the elements out. If you want to use that one, did you did you see that little movement there? Can you see? Hang on. If I go if I go this way, did you see that little movement down there? That's prudence on the sofa. Oh, I, sorry, Danny's just come in. He's bought me a curry for my dinner. You know why? It's because he's going out and leaving me tomorrow all day. Hang on, we're going to see if she's going to get up. Is she going to raise her head or not? I don't want to disturb her. You might see the ears. Oh, <laughs> there she is. That's her. Let her go back to sleep. So that's my companion. She's like my little shadow at the minute. Anyway, so um, where can I get the cheapest beans? They're all saying hello, Danny. They're all saying hello. They're saying hello. Oh, for goodness sake. Everyone's yes. saying hello. Oh, hello, everybody. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. <laughs> so basically, I tried to put on some words that you did ask for, like get well soon. And somebody wanted thank you, not thanks. And then somebody asked for anniversary as well. So hopefully that will cover some of the things you want. But also you've got your birthday hugs and happy birthday on there as well. So cuts in, cuts out. You can extend it if you want to. And it's not too big. It's absolutely beautiful. So that is your bundle. He cracks you up, you honestly, he drives me insane. Danny, can we see another dance? Oh no, the rest of the no one else knows about Danny's dancing in his in his crocs and socks. Um so this is your this is your bundle. Okay. Three, four. Then, 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 then 
the icing on the cake is this beaut. Look at that. Just look at that. Simple, 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 but absolutely glorious. And I think people are going to need this in their life. So I'm just going to say again, make sure you like and share so everybody gets to see this because it's really important because this is the beginning of a range we've started in this font, which is beautiful. And you also get on the back, which, Kathy, what is the one, what size are you asking about? Which, which ones? If it's the sentiments, sorry about the light. If it's those, they are 154 mil long by 9.1 centimetres wide millimeters wide not cent millimeters about a centimeter tall these these are cracking as well you're going to love these they're big but not too big so the largest word which is fabulous obviously that is nine centimeters for the outside cutting edge and i'll show you some some let me show you the samples of that first okay i've not got these on cards yet but i've cut them in black so using my hand will give you a give you an idea so that is oh let me do it on my top <laughs> i'm gonna get it at the right angle so that's the size of it and then you get the backing layer as well I haven't even had a chance to glue them down and i think these are beautiful i think they are going to be very very popular andy yes they will all be on crank oh they are all on crank craft website oh that's good 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 i'm good. <laughs> thank goodness for that but they've only put a limited amount on them. They will load the rest of the stock on Tuesday. All right. Shall I pop down and eat your curry? No, you will not. Just get you around the corner. You're not having my curry, Mandy. But I did get it from the Viceroy and it's really good. Um, so well, he did get it from the Viceroy, not I did. So that's those. They are great. So you're going to get fabulous. I'll do it on my chest because it's easier. Smile. You're going to get friend. And I love this. I love the G on this. Hugs. And we're going to get one more. We're going to get the hello. Lots of people say there was too many hellos around, but I think you can never own enough hellos on a card. Hugs and hellos. Or, or that'd be nice if you had fabulous hugs like that. So you get all your matte and layers that go with those as well. So I've just cut them in different colours. They're all ready for TV. So I'll pop those all together for cards for TV. But they're going to be a staple. We do have phrases out as well, but they're not coming to this show. So it is going to be a theme. There will be Christmas versions as well. So you really, really, really need to, um, if you like these, grab them. Because I won't be able to order many more of those because I, I'm obviously spending for Christmas. Because Christmas is in June on Cret and Craft, as you know, or most of you know. So... That's the first one. Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to flick you around onto the overhead because I want to show you a couple of things. Right, let me come in a little bit. Because I'm sweating. I'm absolutely roasting up here. It's so baking. I've got the curtains closed. And it's about like 100 degrees in here. Have you ever seen me sweat so much? I feel all shiny today. So... Right, let me flick you over and move my phone and everything else out of the way. And let's try and make a bit more sense of this. So here we go. Right, there's my desk. That, that's my machine. Um, but I just want to show you. Let me just make sure these are the ones that are run over. Let me get my packages because we can open my packages. So as you know, that's the one we've just looked at. I think I've knocked my camera slightly as well. So apologies about that. I have knocked it a little bit, so you're a little bit wonky there. But hugs, hello, and all those. Now, let's let's move on. Let's move on, because I haven't finished showing you what I've got yet. Okay, that's that. I'll put that over there, this one. So let's open this and have a look. Sorry about that light just reflecting, but I'll take it out of the package. You see, it's a lot of dyes in here. A lot of dyes. So let me bring them all out. There's tons of them. Tons of the fellas okay honestly it's so it's so warm here i'm really i genuinely my face i've never been so um even got even got sweat on my lips it's just honestly it's boiling in here and it's given me a curry for my dinner <laughs> bless his heart so all of this is in the one pack 
there's a lot in here so you're going to get a lot of metal for your money now when you cut this let me get one that i've cut already i haven't cut the flowers so i might show you a sample i might cut the flowers let's give it a go in a minute so when you cut this die that's what you get on the edge so bring those over oh i nearly showed you something then i don't want to show you let me find a different piece of card let me find a piece of black card to pop this on or you're going to see the next thing i don't want you to see yet which is not good so pop it onto the edge of a card so you can have it like that look at that so it's cracking like that isn't it now it's gorgeous it's such a gorgeous set glowing feel i like that <laughs> i think it's my age if i'm honest right so the other die this one it looks strange again but it has the same edge all right now what you're going to do is you're going to ink this you're going to put this in your favorite color or you're going to cut it in a different color card and then you will pop that just turn this around you'll pop that behind so it's an exact replica, but just the outside edge. You see what I mean now? So it fills it in. It could be the light making me glow, Gail. <laughs> so they're going to look really, really pretty when you've got your ink behind those. And we've got something else that goes with it in a minute, and I'll show you. But what you can do, let's leave that like that for a minute. You've got all your other bits. So here's just a few that are cut. They're the big ones. There's another one. So these are the big ones. Little prudence hair there move that out of the way and then you've got little ones as well so you're going to get all your open ones as well so all of these are going to fit beautifully like so yeah that light i'll tell you for why i'm going to just do something my big light is on i'm just going to go and turn my big light off so excuse me a second that's better we've lost all that shadow now yeah i knew that because i've had the light on in here because the curtains were closed sorry about that so that's that's way better look at that so now if we start looking we can go okay well how does this work then so now what we've got we've got the, the die that cuts out the layer for everything so straight over the top to cut it out and you've got your layer like so you've got it with all the sizes now i've got a little sample here of it this is the only sample I've got done so far. And this is how I've done it. Okay, this is my papers on my texture cards on the show as well. So I've mixed them, mi mixed and matched them. Okay. And I've put the open ones with the um, closed ones as well. This is the sentiment. That's the one I've trimmed it off there. You don't have to. You can just pop yours into the size, as in, into, the, into the card if you like. Okay, so hi from Winnipeg. Brilliant. I love to, I love seeing where everybody's from. You haven't told me where you're from actually tonight, and I didn't ask you, did I? So that's the first one. And look at this. So this is the die that's going to cut. Let let me cut one out and just show you. Let me just cut out one of these so you can see. Let me just bring in my die cut machine just so you can see how big that is because it's so lovely when that cuts out and it's so detailed i hadn't planned on doing this but you know we're live we can do what we like and we're in no rush so okay bring this back look at that so that should that is how detailed they are isn't it lovely absolutely lovely really really like these so hopefully there'll be something you like as well so pop it like that if you want to or you can turn it around you can mix and match them you can do whatever you like with them they are um they're brilliant okay so that's that one and they cut out really really easily so let's go to that bow hang on let me pop these back in the pack because these are my tv ones and if i lose these okay so they did load some on i'm not sure how many they loaded but i promise you if they were there and they've gone they will be back i haven't actually looked today i've been so busy that i haven't checked 
what was loaded. Did anyone see them loaded? Okay, pop that. Pop them back in the, the packaging. Okay. That's that one. Pop that down there. So the next one is the bow. Now let me take all these ones up. Actually, when you do that though, just to show you those sentiments as well, if you pop the sentiment down and you've got, um, look at that. So if you could just have fabulous and you've got loads of my stamps, you'll have one that says friend, but you have got the die if you wanted to put that on. So you, I mean, these are the wrong colours. So it fits beautifully like so. And then you've got the flowers. So you could be building up your flower like so, however you do it. So you can really make a card really quickly if you want to, okay? So they are cracking, but let's go to the next one. I'm gonna to have to move the black card because I did this one on black for a reason. Now, this one is a similar thing. So you're gonna get, I won't take it out, but you're gonna get that edge, okay? And you've also got that one which cuts into the card. Okay. Maybe they maybe they've seen they're selling hard, selling fast. I don't know. I don't know. They should be there. They were on when I looked this afternoon. Oh, maybe some have gone then. That's all I can say. Don't know. Can load individually, but not the bundle. If you can't add it to buzz it because there is a yeah that's right it must be that some have gone already then okay so that's what you get now look when you cut this out <laughs> look at that isn't that beautiful so you've got two smaller ones two slightly bigger ones and a bigger one there now the, the other piece that cuts out is that so it, it won't cut it how it would just cut the edge it's not going to cut all this bit i just trimmed that off now that to me looks like butterflies so you could put something in the middle and they're just butterflies you could put hang on where's the die gone again hang on where's it pick it up if you look at the back of the die here you've got this long bit here which is to go in the bow which i'm going to show you in a second i'll show you now actually so there's one of the bows Okay, so you could use that bit in the middle to go in the middle of your butterfly there or create and call it a butterfly if you wanted to. So now if you pop that behind there, how gorgeous is that? And I think, think of that in red and green. Think of that. I mean, it's, it looks like it's not even, but it is. It's just where my camera is and I've knocked the angle. So it looks a bit um, fisheye. But you can see now, that they are equal either end. They're beautiful. And actually, if you wanted to, you could paper piece those. They'd look cool. And also think about, I know it's not the right card to do it on. But think about this. You can obviously have them as edges on your card because they cut into the card. Aren't they cracking? They really are. I think, see what I mean? I think this is a beautiful, beautiful release. Really beautiful and a usable release. This is going to see you through Christmas as well. It really is. If pinks and green, reds and greens would be lovely in that. And then you've got your flowers as well. So, you know, even like so, when you've got your flowers, you know, they really are going to be a pretty set to use. Really lovely. And as I said, there is one of the bows, but there are lots of bows in the set as well. So do them in your favourite colours. I think you're going to really enjoy these. So the next, next one we've got is the... Uh, what do you call it? The um, the wreath, the wreath, the wreath, the wreath, the summer wreath. Now I haven't I haven't got a sample of this, so I thought what we could do is get this one out quickly. Uh, Christmas, oh my goodness, Christmas! I've got to tell you, I have got a mega Christmas release this year. I'm not going to lie, I'm not going to lie. It is a mega release, but oh my goodness. I tell you now, you are going to adore it. It is, I've got a die release and an embossing folder release, obviously. I would always do that, wouldn't I? So I'm going to cut these two out. Let me grab some green cards. Um, 
let's grab some green and uh, some yellow. Yeah, let's grab some green and yellow and see what it looks like. Yeah, that looked quite cool. Yeah, so Christmas is uh, outstandingly good and I will be on for Christmas on the 26th of June. I think it launches on the 24th, but I'm on on the 26th. So let's take the first die. No, we're going to do that one first, I think. Excuse the mess here. And I've got my little scissors here, which is ridiculous, Lisa. But hey-ho. So that's the first one. I'm going to be spending all my weekend. I'm taking Lily out on Saturday, and then I'll be spending the rest of the weekend going to Brighton on Saturday. And the rest of the weekend is going to be me sample making so it doesn't look like mary did all the work <laughs> she probably will do most of it though bless her right so we're just going to die cut these two now we do it one at a time because i can't fit them on well i can but i've not cut my card to size which is ridiculously silly of me so run that through let's bring it back because it's easier let me grab that out and Oh, this is lovely. This is lovely. This is lovely. It's all stitched as well. Come on, you little. There we are. I'm on about telly now, and even when I haven't got them on, it's a nightmare. So, oh, Lisa, you pulled it now. Careful. So, there you go. There's one half of your wreath. One half. So, let's do. The outside cutting is obviously you're going to cut it twice but then we'll do the other side now so i've got that random piece of card now this is your mat and layer you don't have to use this but i thought it's quite nice now your wreath let me just give you another heads up christmas is coming so as we've got a wreath i haven't done another wreath but i might have done some things to go on a wreath okay so from my point of view it saves um me bringing out two different products it saves you some money um and it will work for all occasions so this wreath is going to be the wreath for christmas as well all right so if you are thinking of christmas cards this is going to be perfect because you've got the little berries as well in here let me bring these actually you can see them on this card here on the card here we've got the berries Okay, but you obviously you won't do yours in purple, you do yours in red or white or whatever. Oh, thank you, Sarah. Oh, thank you. Lily, oh, she's lovely. She's such a quiet, unassuming child. She's an absolute pleasure. She's a pleasure. I adore her, absolutely adore her. We were blessed with her. She's lovely. Anyway, so... Two of those is going to make you a beautiful wreath and then what you can do if you want to you can pop it on here like so you will glue yours down because i've pulled it out it's slightly misshapen but that again how pretty is that and that gives you an oh wait oh diane wait a minute i haven't got there yet <laughs> I'll show you them in a minute. They're, they're cool. Um, so on the back, it gives you a little bit bigger area for you to be able to to use it. Now you can you can trim this off. So again, I keep coming back to this card. I know it's because you know what I've got, but you can trim the bits off here, and you could have popped this around there. And actually, if you put it on the card, what's really nice, it would be nice as a half. See what I mean? It would be nice off the edge as well. It's such a pretty shape. You can make it bigger, you can overlay it, you can have different colours, and I think you're going to like that. And that, again, is why it's in the bundle. Now, again, I will show you, hang on, I will show you the, the next one, because although it's a sentiment, it is going to be very, very useful. So let me put all these bits back in here. Lily is definitely a mini me. She's um she used to be more like a dad. She's got a dad's legs, unfortunately. Um, but she's got my temperament and she's um she's a worrier as well. She's like me. We're terrible worriers and we worry about it even if it hasn't happened, and we just if we haven't got anything to worry about, we worry about that. <laughs> but that's just our nature and um I'll never try and change her. I always say don't worry about it, and then she said, Well, you do. 
and I do I'm a nightmare but she's doing the GCSEs at the moment and um it's been a tough week I think very tough week she's had everything from learning about oh, oh, oh she had RE which was I think it was Islam she's had maths I don't think it was the tough one yet but she's had maths she's had the crime and punishment for history she's had english literature romeo and juliet she's had bless her she's had some tough, tough old ones okay so this is the next die now this is this is worth every penny this is huge look at all these so you get all of these all of these words now as i said they are about 15 centimeters so let's use the get well soon for example so they are designed to be a very similar size to your frame so let me bring in the black one because it will be easier let's bring in this one so the length of that you can see if you want to you can pop your sentiment underneath there now what you could also do is pop your sentiment there but then take your outside edge pop that down and cut it and it will give you the stitched edge as well so you can cut that bring that down a bit and then also you can use the scalloped edge if you want to do that all right so that's that so that's how that works it's really 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 worth it that one and i would highly recommend it so that's in the bundle so that's your four in the bundle and then obviously you get the bold words which are the sentiments which are a separate set now the other thing i want to tell you about is the little little dots the little dots that you keep seeing now what we're doing is these beauties so i will take them out let me let me take these ones out first you're going to get a set of four you're going to get four packs not two packs hi hi Mer 01 you're new well welcome welcome Gail, I look really brown. Have I been sunbathing? No, it hasn't been very nice weather, has it? Can you see the cat scars here as well? But, but I will be honest with you, I have got some new cream from L'Occitane and it's really lovely and it's really dewy and, and I wonder if that's why my face looks like it as well. <laughs> it's really lovely. It's given me like, um, given me like a glow, isn't it? So anyway, I digress. I digress talking about my skin. So these are beautiful. Now they're three millimeters. So they are like little tiny dew drops, and you get 150 on each. So you're going to get two like this, and then you're going to get two of the clear. Now let me lift these out because these make your little dew drops on your leaves. So if you're thinking about this being a, hang on, let's bring this one in again, pop those ones down. If you bring this one in again, you can pop these just little ones on your leaves and they look like little raindrops they are absolutely beautiful so they are a glass dome so they're not um they're not a gem then they've not got a coating on them they are absolutely um clear but they are they're also they're also quite domed and they are sticky backed as well so you're going to get two of those i've only got one up here but you're going to get two of those and you're going to get two of those as well. So you're going to get uh, 600 lots of 600 domes to be using. But they're pretty. They're a tiny little size. And I think you're going to really like them. You get five different colours on the pastel. So you get, let me just go in. You get a, I don't know if you can see them very well. You get a blue, a peach, a lemon, a pink and a green. So they're going to work beautifully. All the colours as well. They work beautifully on Oh, they're lovely. The pink ones, the peachy ones look lovely on the green as well. So these are going to be a little thing to keep you, to give your cards just that little bit of oomph. And again, when I bring that in, you can see how pretty they are. They are super pretty. That's the clear ones. And I've even used them in the center of the flowers as well. So are the Aurora domes coming back into stock? I can't get them at the moment cannot get them for love nor money and they they got really expensive because they're quite heavy they um were looking for something like two thousand pounds for shipping them i was like what and i have to pop them myself as well you see so then i have to get the pots as well and everything is a bit bit difficult at the moment um, but these are all done for me so these are beautiful so 
that is your deal. Let me come back now. Let me come back and see you. Let me, let me come back. So, just turn my glasses off. That's better. So what have we got in the show? Should we recap? Let's recap. Good, this one, good. There's a lot, there's a lot, there's a lot. So, oh, let me move some stuff out of the way or it's all gonna go flying. I've probably missed stuff as well. I know what I'm like. This, back in stock. Back in stock. Back in stock. Could you imagine those little gems on there? Oh, and your sentiment. Okay, can you imagine that in the middle of the wreath? That's going to be cool. And then we get into these two, which are going to work. Now you've seen these you know why they're there cracking limited stock those and then we get our bundle which is one two three four well i've got two down here now oh goodness me i've done it again i knew it was going to happen pop that down there we're going to oh before we do anything else back in stock back in stock and then we've got that 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 and that that make your bundle and then we've got that as a separate i nearly put it in the bundle but i thought we overpriced the bundle and it might be something that you it prevents you from buying the bundle and i didn't want that to happen because i think you'd really really like the bundle and obviously these these as well so that's it have you got any questions i'm gonna have a quick look before we go because it's 752 the layering tulip they've not been ordered yet sarah but they will be are these coming to craft stash yes they will be coming to craft stash okay what else have we got let's keep i'm gonna go back a little bit so i can catch up because i'm sure this comments um I wait to see for Christmas. When are you on Selly Telly Lisa? Sorry if I missed it. I'm on a Tuesday, 6 p.m. for the launch of the one-day special. Can we have a sneak peek, please? What what was that? Did I miss that? Was it a Christmas? No. I've got what I can't show you. Right, look, I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna do something really bad now. Really bad. Okay, it's not bad. Sorry, I've got my I've got my shorts on as well, so apologies. Um this here, hang on, oh my goodness, this, right, <laughs> and, oh, I can't tell you I'm just going to go, dies, is what I can tell you about Christmas, right, I'm going to tell you one more thing though about Christmas, and it's not, it's one item, but it might involve, if you've got, it's not an essential, but it might involve using something like this, right? Just saying, okay. <laughs> it's gorgeous. Okay, that was really bad, wasn't it? Will there be any stencils for Christmas? Hell yes, there will. Yeah, they're all done. Some are on my wall <laughs> in the shop. So I can't show you. 26th of June is my daughter's birthday and you are... I'm going to see Rag and Bone Man on the 27th. Oh, I love Rag and Bone Man. Did you... Did I hear you right? I do, but it won't be till September for the Christmas washi. Um, what time? 24th the 6th, 6 p.m.? Let me keep going. Where do you get the clear spots? And we've done the clear spots. Um, um, Miriam, I think I'm launching the one day specials. So it'd be six o'clock, I think. So let's keep looking. Let me create crafts. 
Okay, glitter card. Will the will the coloured glitter card be back? No, it won't. The reason I I say that is because it, it's something to do with the electricity in um, China. So when they manufacture, I, for some reason, it uses a lot of electricity to shoot the the glitter. So it means I have to buy in. I, I've never never heard of the, the the sheer volume that is required to, to order this card but for glitter card at the moment it is phenomenally expensive to bring so i won't at the moment but if the price does come down i might get it shipped by container and then but i will let you know at the moment i'm looking at some gorgeous christmas colors okay um am i going back to crafters tv possibly Yes, no, I haven't sorted out anything with them as yet. Um, is there going to be snowflakes or flowers? Is that for Christmas dyes or is that for embossing folders, Hayley? Because I can say yes and yes. <laughs> okay, don't let your curry go cold. Will the satin card be back? No, that was a one-off, unfortunately can't bring the satin card stock back not at that price unfortunately that was a, a a special deal um i managed to get because i ordered so much of some other things um i can't get it back at that price it would probably be oh goodness me it'd probably be an extra 10 pounds on top if i had to reorder that so um not sure not sure but it's it makes it a lot more expensive okay slimline layering stencils when are they coming out i will tell you that let me look at my schedule and i will tell you that here and now let me check something tells me hang on i will have a quick look at my folder Right, yep, yeah, found that. It will be a landing with me on the 17th of June. So because we've got Christmas on the 26th of June, it will be the first event in July, I would think. Okay. Have you found Yanis's hedgehogs yet? Don't please don't talk to me about Yanis's hedgehogs. It makes me twitch. <laughs> And I think, hello from Croatia. Oh, goodness me. I hope you're having a lovely holiday. I think that is it. So, any questions before I go? Any questions? I'm going to wait a couple of minutes to see if there is anything you need to know. I'm sure I had things to tell you, and I can't remember. Oh! Giveaway, giveaway, likes and shared. For those of you who liked and shared, you are in chance of winning a giveaway. And I need to I need to tell you the giveaway winners from last week. So last week's giveaway winners, there were going to be two. And we did one um, for a favorite product, and we did one for uh, liking and sharing. So the winner of who said what their favorite product was is Kim Holding, and the winner of the giveaway is Jan Holsom. Holsman. Holsom. Holsman. That's because I'm waiting for my dinner, you see. So, congratulations to you both. There will be another winner for tonight. And I haven't decided what I'm giving away yet. But it will be gorgeous prizes as always. So please, please, please make sure you set your timers and you get ready for the one day special because I think it's going to be a fast moving show. OK, um, have a lovely weekend, everybody. Whatever you're doing, stay safe. Look after yourself and each other. And I'll see you at six o'clock. Go back to the Facebook group, create Crafting with Lisa Horton, have a look because I have put an, on the up into the top a list of upcoming dates. You're still able to get your discount for your um, live craft along with me, I think. If you can't, let me know and we'll extend it. 
Um, so if you want to craft along with me next Friday, you're more than welcome to do so. It'll be all on the overhead and we will do, it will be a bit longer. So it might be an hour, hour and a half. So make sure you've got the time free or at least time to watch back anyway, because it will be a cracking little class. Um, it's watercolouring with the Wild Peony and my watercolour Euphoria paints. Okay. And that's it. Thank you for good luck to wish wishes to Lily and I will see you all on the telly on Tuesday. Take care everyone. Bye.